okay, we have a coin join transaction where we have like hundreds of equal outputs or, or not equal outputs. So we have some, t- some type of enhanced privacy on chain. Uh, then, then it's also, it also means that the adversary or the on chain, uh, eavesdropper cannot know which Bitcoin entity funded, uh, that specific, uh, lightning channel. Moreover, if we have that proof, then this, Payment channel opening is even indistinguishable from re- regular uh, uh, Bitcoin transactions and uh, and UTXOs. Yeah, right. That's the second aspect. So CoinJoin solves the peeling chain issue with the amount correlation, and uh, Taproot solves the uh, in the identification based on different script types. Right. So your change will always be your single public key, while that your channel is always that multi-sig script, right, or that hash time lock contact and cooperative close. Well, with Taproot, well, single signatures, multi-signatures, and adapter signatures all look exactly the same. And that covers uh, most of the Lightning Network on-chain fingerprints based on scripts. Yes, and um, I'm kind of an evangelist of uh, of making this a, a reality, but I think you are as well, Max. So I... Th- um, one of the future avenues for um, collaborations for Wasabi, I see it uh, uh, lightning integration or some kind of uh, collaboration between LND and other clients. I think uh, it should be the norm, like to uh, if we want any kind of meaningful privacy guarantees or provisions on layer two, that every payment channel opening should should occur inside a coin join and. and um, it would be really nice to make this a reality in, I don't know, one or two years. I mean, we have so much work to do and, and, uh, there's little time and there's little energy. There's little human resource. Like, would be nice to have a Wasabi mobile wallet. I don't know. So there's a lot of work to be done. And, but one of the most important, uh, in the long term, definitely after Wabi Sabi, uh, is, is, is lightning because, uh, the whole world uh, is will be going, uh, hopefully, to layer two because uh, that's the only way to go, I think, in the long term. Especially if we will have, I don't know, one one million dollars per Bitcoin, uh, then off chain transact on chain transactions will be quite expensive. Who knows? I mean, we are, we cannot really tell the future, but uh, I think that's the big trend we need to see here. And um, if if the world is moving off chain. Uh, then we need to have privacy on chain because uh, privacy is the oxygen of Bitcoin. It's it's a little bit invisible. Uh, you don't really see that there's there, but once it's not there, we are just screwed. Uh, 